I stay here with the KSW Onward, the one of most Europeans respectable promoter, Mr. Martin Lewandowski. Martin, it's Hello. a pleasure for us, for our first time in Brazil, to talk with you. How's it going? And uh, how, how, how do you think about this beautiful country like Japan? Yeah, this is my fourth time already here. So I've been with Mohamed Kalido before. Uh, so I visit nearly all Japan. So, you know, I'm glad I just got from the plane. So I had two hours sleep. So I'm kind of dizzy, let's say. But, but yeah, enjoy to be here. In, that, in this time, you, you which Goro Relic, Goron is, is still be fighting tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And uh, how is your, uh, how do you expect about Goron, Goron's performance uh, right now in Rising? He's very focused, very uh, calm. And uh, I think the first fight should be, should be, you know, maybe not easy, but it will be, I, I think Goron is just better fighter. Uh, and the second, the second fighter he might have, might be a bit tougher, but uh, I mean, the, 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 I'm afraid of two fighters in that tournament, but I won't tell you who, <laughs> we can talk after the show. Uh, yeah, so, I don't know, the, the, the way how I know Goran, so he's really focused, you know, it's kind of his time right now, so he's got good attitude, he's got good motivation, so I'm glad to see him in that shape. And uh, we talk about rising. Uh, how Sakakibara san meet you uh, to find you? Because uh, this deal, this big deal with, with rising, with uh, KSW promotion and, uh, and others promotion like Bellator, Bama. Uh, in your vision, how this deal can change our MMA world? You mean the cooperation? Yes, with, with yes. The, um I mean, it's, uh, it, it become a huge, if of course it will succeed, so it might be a, a, a powerful organization and it, uh, I'm glad that so many different promoters support Mr. Saki Kabara. So um, I think it will change if it's, you know, if it lasts for, for a year or two, I think it will change uh, and I wish uh, we could see uh, Japan uh, big and rising with this show so big as it used to be in all the times. And uh, uh, do you expect more KSW fight, fight, fighters coming to compete rising too? Sure, of course. It's just, you know, I came here with one fighter for a show, um, but yeah, definitely yes. And uh, uh, a lot of humors talk about Marius Pruzanowski face Fedor. Uh, do, do you think this fight can be happening in the future? Because uh, Marius made a fight in October and uh, now, uh, right now he needs to rest to, to recover about the loss and uh, get, get ready on track. Yes, I think, you know, everything's possible. So if Marius, you know, put himself together in one piece and he show the best he can do and he showed that he can do really great uh, his last performance wasn't uh, wasn't good uh, so uh, I think yeah it, it, it's possible um, I, I wonder how good Feather is because I've met him a year ago in Russia so he was saying that he's not going he's not thinking of going back to, to MMA again you know, so we'll see in what condition Feder is, because as I remember him in old times, so he was just you know monster, you know. So Marius couldn't couldn't uh, stand and trade with him for one round, but maybe you know the Marius uh, grew a little bit. Feder maybe his better his best time is just gone, so maybe there are some chances. <laughs> And then, uh, are you surprised uh, when you receive the news, oh, Fedor is back? Mm -hmm. uh, do, do you think uh, F Fedor can, can be sh really put a good performance? Because, uh, would you just be honest, uh, Jaidipsi Jai is young, he's dangerous in stand-up, but he, he, he needs he need to improve in the ground. And how, how is your, uh, uh, your vision about this fight? Uh, against Fedor, I don't against know. I don't know. I don't want to say. I don't want to speculate. I think you know. It's just too, too, um, 
I know too little about Fedor right now, and I know too little about his opponent. It's just a fight between the being a young and being experienced. You know, and I think this what happened, and this what will compete and and uh, strike. So um, we'll see. But I think you know, on my show, it happened that um, these who are younger. Uh, loses with talented talent and and uh, with experience so we'll see and uh, talk about our case dub right now and uh, uh, how is your plans for 2016 we have a, a, a one event scheduled for March Boris Mankovsky and Thomas Narcon is back mm -hmm. is he and especially for Nar Narcon is the first title defense against a big victory in uh, uh, face yeah. uh, Gorelich uh, how do you think he's the, the next show to Polish Polish fans uh, we know uh, KSW made a lot a lot of special shows big shows and uh, what did you, do you expect to the next event in March we were going back after a couple couple years going back to Warsaw again so uh, this is our hometown this is where KSW was born uh, so what just to, to keep the same quality of the, 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 the show and everything what, what matters is the fighters and their fights and their skills so we'll give a good show and uh, uh, in, in this, this, this month where we see a Karolina Kovacic made in debut UFC she was a, a champion before mm -hmm. uh, do, do you think if, uh, do you think KSW can be do another uh, a ti a title fight to uh, which, which, uh, another girls do you have a plan about that I don't understand like what sorry uh, and you have a uh, Carolina Carolina moved to UFC yeah uh, and uh, now she she not uh, case will not have a, a woman champion do you think do you think uh, do you want to to do uh, a title fight uh, which uh, tune uh, new contenders yeah sure I mean we're not going to stop uh, uh, the women's division because Carolina um, is gone right now uh, we have started the uh, um, promoting female fight uh, in MMA uh, this is like something which is going on we have a new a new Polish uh, uh, girl hired uh, she unfortunately lost we have Brazilian fighters who you know she won and she will be back uh, in the middle of 2016 uh, we have some other girls you know on I so we could we could see how they go. So yeah, it will it will happen. It just you know, Carolina was a, was a, a huge because of us because we made her so popular. She's good in her um, MMA. I'm glad that all the fighters who come to UFC at least the first fight they are winning. You know because the, the late. Show, show the, the quality of KSW yeah, too, so because... Yeah, 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 so because also people compare this, yes? If it's, for example, if the, the champion is coming to UFC and you can imagine what would happen if she or he would lose first fight, you know, with any fighter in, in UFC. And uh, uh, are you shocked about the result of the legendary fight uh, with, with Michal Matela and uh, Mamed Khalidov? A KO in first round. Yes, I was shocked because of the first round. I didn't want to make any any um, you know voting or or I didn't keep my finger crossed for Mamed or for Michal. Uh, I just you know I just really wanted to have a good fight, and um, the only thing I'm missing was just it was too short. Uh, so that was the shock. But Mamed won. People were saying yeah, it was obvious. It wasn't so obvious for me, you know, uh, um, two months ago. So, and uh, the, the the last question is: uh, KSW made uh, the first big event outside Poland. Uh, you, uh, do do you have a plans to do uh, uh, to reach another countries? Uh, any anything is going to happen right now? Sure, we are we are looking at the, you know. Uh, different countries, of course, uh, we have narrowed the, the number uh, of countries where MMA is uh, is a discipline or is known. So we don't go to a country where people don't know what MMA is. 
And the second um, option is uh, we also need to look because uh, we don't have this um, international promotion, uh, so we need to look also where Poles live. So um, the next uh, countries, for example, we are thinking of, I'm not saying it's going to happen in 2016 or 17. I don't know when, I don't know uh, where and everything. It will be Germany and the US. So these are the, 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 the countries uh, where, where we could, we think we might succeed. And uh, 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 we, we have, a, uh, in this year, 2015, KSW made a first uh, live broadcast in Brazil. Mm -hmm. uh, it, it's it's big, a little bit surprising for Brazilian fans. Mm -hmm. Wow, wow! We can stop reach the the big big television because TV Sports Interativo is the today in Brazil the, the, is the the the, the, uh, the number one mm -hmm. in MMA because we have a lot a lot of events, a lot of fighters. Uh, do do you think this deal can be continued in 2016? Sure. Of course, Brazil is a huge in MMA also, so you know, it's 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 a little bit far from Poland, <laughs> and it's you know different mentality which also matters doing a business. So, um, but yes, we we are broadcast right now in more than forty countries: uh, Brazil, Japan, US, you know, Scandinavian countries, England. Uh, they are very important for us as a, as a, as a, a countries to reach with our product. Martin, thank you so much. Thank you. If you can send a message for the the KSW fans first, and uh, all fans of MMA, you you come to see the rising, but we not can forget the the KSW because KSW is an awesome show for sure. Thank you very much for this nice words. You know, I'm glad you know to hear that, and I, I would like to uh, see more Brazilians uh, on the fight card, more Brazilians watching KSW in front of TV and, and cheering up all the fighters, not only the Brazilian ones.